Choosing the right text style and having it contribute to your image is what every designer wants. In this video, I'll show you how to manipulate text using a basic tool in Photopea. Today, we'll be creating this flashlight effect. It's a simple effect that doesn't require any advanced knowledge of Photopea. Let's start with a blank background and add our text. Select the Type tool from the toolbar. Then increase its size so it's more visible. While we're here, let's change its color to white and press OK. I'll type the word SHINE in capitals. You can manipulate its size and position by selecting the Move tool and confirming that Transform Controls is selected. Now just press and drag from a corner to increase its size. Let's change the font style by selecting the character icon from the sidebar. Select any style you like. In this example, I'll use the Anton font. Now let's reposition the text to the center of the canvas. We can use the red vertical and horizontal lines as a guide. When the crosshairs appear, the text is centered. Next, we need to make a duplicate of the text layer. Select the layer, then right-click to open a menu. Choose Duplicate Layer. The layer copy is on top. Hide it by pressing on the icon. Then select the original text layer and double-click to open a menu. Choose Blending Options. Here we can customize the text layer. We'll focus on just a few of its parameters. Let's start by adding a bevel and emboss. Then press to see a list of options. Change the style to outer bevel. Then choose a depth of 30%. Make the size 20 pixels. And put the softness level at 5. Move down to mode and change it to screen. Then increase both opacity levels to 100%. Next, select the color overlay and change its color to something dark, but not too dark. It basically needs to be brighter than a black background. When satisfied, select OK and close out the menu. Next, turn the bottom text layer off and turn the copy layer back on. Select the copy layer. Then move to the marquee icon at the top of the toolbar. There are two options. Choose the ellipse option. Let's also apply feathering to soften its edges. In this effect, we'll max it out at 100 pixels. We can turn the ellipse into a circle by pressing the shift key as we make the selection. Start by pressing anywhere on the canvas. Then hold the shift key as you drag the circle across the text. Then release when done. You can move the selection by pressing anywhere inside the circle. Center it using the crosshairs as a guide. Next, add a raster mask to the top layer by pressing the icon on the bottom menu. Then turn the bottom text layer back on. The effect is partially done. We just need to add a black background to see it in full. Select the background layer. Then scroll down to the adjustment layer icon. Scroll back up and choose color fill. Then select a black background and click OK. And there is the completed effect. I think it looks good. What do you think? Let me know in the comment section. If you'd like to see more content like this, learn more about Photopea, subscribe to my channel, or view one of my other videos. Thank you.